Valiant's take on the comic book uh, genre is just a much more modern 90s uh, take on uh, the superhero genre. And I think it that's what makes it much more relatable to today's audience. And hopefully it makes the character much more relatable to the movie going audience as well. Bloodshot is the flagship character of the whole Valiant comic book uh, uh, line. And uh, when they decided to relaunch Valiant Comics in 2012, uh, the character they decided to launch with was Bloodshot because it's such an iconic character and that's what made us so excited to take that character and translate it into uh, the cinema. Vin is so internal, he uh, kind of agonizes kind of over every decision to what makes something great, what makes a character great. And I think that so much of that is inherent in the Bloodshot character. He was able to transfer so much of what makes him such a good actor and such a great action hero and turn that into something that made the Bloodshot character kind of organic to what that character was in the comics, but he was able to expand on that and make it even deeper, more interesting, more fun, more complex. I think he's a much different kind of superhero than we've seen in the, in the past, you know. Uh, he's, he's much more emotional, uh, much more complex, very conflicted, doesn't really know where his place in the world is, but he also has these superhuman strengths that makes him um, somebody that is very difficult to measure up against, but it also causes a lot of conflict within for him having these uh, powers. Because this movie is so complicated and there's so much technology involved in front of the camera, behind the camera, um, having Dave Wilson, who has had a tremendous uh, visual effects career um, prior to this, um, at the helm and knowing how to get s more out of less um, was really helpful to make this movie feel the scale that it does. I mean, this movie, the scale of this movie is, feels like you've traveled all around the world using all the highest technologies in the world. And to me, it's just like, as a cinema geek, it's just to be able to see all this on film, on the big screen, uh, only somebody of Dave's caliber could have made this happen.